<laughs> Hi, I'm Hannah and in this video I'm going to be talking you through everything you need to know about standardised age scores. Before we continue, please do click the like and subscribe button. It helps us to grow this channel and bring you high quality content like this every week. For those of you who are new to standardised age scores, they are used in 11 plus exams to ensure that results are compared fairly. This is because children born in August, for example, are nearly a year younger than children born in September, so age standardisation helps to account for this. It's important to remember that while younger children can gain marks, older children will never lose marks for their age. The first step in age standardisation is calculating an attainment estimate. This takes into account the number of questions your child answered correctly and the difficulty level of these questions. After this, the second step is adjusting each child's scores based on their age at the time of taking the test. And this is measured in years and months. SAS scores normally tend to range from 60 to 142. A score of 80 or below would place your child in the lowest 10% of the year group. A score of 100 is exactly average and a score of 120 or above would place your child in the top 10% of their year group. For more competitive grammar and independent schools, we recommend aiming for an SAS of 120 and above. Some, but not all, grammar schools have also set standardised pass marks. If you do want more information on this, check out the link in our description below. If you have an Atom Learning subscription, you'll be able to see your child's standardised age score after every mock test they complete. When they complete a mock test, you'll see details such as their SAS, their ability in all of the tested subtopics, and how they compare against other children applying for the same target school. I hope this video was helpful. If you're looking for more information about Results Day itself, check out our other video where we tell you everything you need to know and what to expect. If you have any questions, please do leave us a comment below.